Who's that lurking in the shadows? It's Papa Ferk. Papa, Papa, Papa Ferk. On the streets of Rage Quit with Lee Casey, Jesse Bloomhagen. We're back for the second episode of Demon Souls. Do you know that, do you know that song reference I just said was? Um, you know what? I think we were like, we were on the same, same wavelength, but then the moment that you Other sang way. it, it fucking threw me off, so you have to tell me now. It's like, who's that lady driving down the road? Who's that lady? Well, who sings that? I don't know. I think it's like a Steppenwolf song. Yeah, I, I couldn't fucking Touch tell you, man. I think I, I was know. thinking of something else entirely. And maybe, maybe, well, I mean, those are pretty common words to be mixed together in a song, so yeah. it's probably existing somewhere. The genericism isn't lost on me. Okay, that guy's oh, fuck, he's got, what the hell is that? Dude, murder that guy. Yo, or girl. God so damn. Kill it. Oh. Kill them. Mm. Okay. They're dead. They're dead. okay. Just joking. <laughs> I got crescent moon grass. I'm really excited about that. Give me your soul. Like David Draymond style. Like, give your fucking soul to me. Release me. Um, can't we do something with these chains? It's like, well, it's bugging me. I, well, there's two chains, so. <laughs> like, like actual two chains? <laughs> no. Like the one that like snorts cocaine fucking two chains? Go that way. This way? Yeah. Okay. Go across the bridge. Can or I run? The wooden thing. Yeah. Circle. But it depletes stamina. Just, oh. FYI, just FYI. You can still use it. Wait, am I going the right way? Yeah, if you want to go up there. Well, you might as well check for items down there. Shit! Just fuck that guy's day up. <laughs> so I wonder if I was playing like this. Because to me, and I might have been playing the same way, you play frantically. So I'm just wondering if I was depleting the stamina just as fast as you were. Because I wasn't I wasn't paying attention to it all the time. Probably. I'm. That's like the last thing I'm looking at. Look how pretty this game is, bro. I'm not looking at a fucking green bar. I'm looking at the environment. That's true. It's so pretty. The PlayStation 5 is unprecedented in terms of raw power. And you know what the crazy thing about this, too? Is that the fucking system, even though it's super massive, it doesn't make a single sound at all. And it has, like, super quick loading time. Yeah, both consoles are fucking ridiculously quiet. Like, they're virtually quiet. Like, I, like you can't hear them. Yeah. I was... Like uses them both to their limits uh, ever since I had them, both the Series X and the PS5. And like I said, nothing on a peep. And yeah. they're running pretty cool. So that's good. Well, I, I well for me, like I, yeah. my only experience was with PlayStation 5 so far. Um, we haven't turned on the Series X, so I like I, I haven't seen it. I haven't heard it. Yeah, we have. No, we haven't. That's how we were when the fuck can we do Series X? Soul Calibur 2 was running on it. Oh, shit. That and was the Series Feud. X? And Family Feud, yeah. Oh, shit. I thought you were just using your Xbox One. One of the, well, plays Xbox One games. So it looked the exact same. Yeah, because they're not, those games weren't optimized for the Series X. Oh. If you were to play a Series X game, like Forza, Horizon 4, or Gears Tactics, then I would show you. I, but you're not missing out on a hot, they, like, they look just as good as like the PS5 stuff. I 100% thought we were playing on the Xbox One the entire time. No, well, I mean, basically. Like, Jesus Christ. You Seriously? Might... At least with the PlayStation 5, you can tell a difference. I know, but this is a PS5 game. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, Xbox doesn't have games. You were playing. You're, sorry, you were playing. A th you're playing a 360 game on a Series X, right. and then you're playing a one game on the Series X. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, well that's good to know. I guess I didn't hear the console then, so yeah. There you go. You proved me wrong. Oh fuck me. <laughs> um. Okay. Roll, bro. Okay. Bro, roll. I'm fucking rolling. Give me a swipe. Give me a swipe. Oh, it's scary. Give fuck, I'm trying. Slice a little time down. Oh, oh, I just got dead. fucked. Okay. You died. However, the Nexus traps you. You shall... Okay. <laughs> the, the Nexopia? Yeah, Nexopia. Remember Nexopia, bro? I remember. Like, only everybody in Canada will remember. <laughs> and not even all of Canada. It's more like a Western Canada thing. It's true, yeah. Like, Alberta. And, like, BC, that was it. Yeah. Yeah, like, no one lives in Saskatchewan. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because we have a subscriber who lives in Saskatchewan and watches us regularly, so shout out. <laughs> shout out to you. I, I'm just kidding. I, 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 I have family in Saskatchewan. Backpedaling. <laughs> but I will be honest, I don't like Saskatchewan. Fair. That's fair. Very flat land. <laughs> but here's the thing. People in Saskatchewan would tell you that, too, because it, there's nothing to do there. It's just all prairie, you know? Yeah. So. Like Regina. Uh, no. Yeah, Regina's a really nice place. So is Saskatoon. I think oh, her. That's, that's I, about it. Bro, I think her Regina is a very nice place. Who is she? Who is that? I don't know. The lady who's reviving. Hang on a sec. She's I'm telling it's Nexus. Is her name Nexus? No. Oh, so the the area is Nexus. So since you died, hand, hand that thing over home. Okay, hang on a sec. <laughs> Just give me a haptic feedback experience for a minute. Is it rumbling? Don't worry, I'll, I'll give you the controller. Why is it on your crotch? 
It's all on my cross. It's in my hand. <laughs> if it was on my dink, then I'd, I'd have a heart on right now. <laughs> you have died, and Nexopia has imprisoned your soul. You cannot escape Nexopia Plus. Okay. You have to go mod Is that fishing. the Virgin Mary, bro? No, maybe. Is that the Virgin Mary? Power of, by capturing demon souls, you can reclaim your corporeal, corporeal body. body. You know, I got I to gotta tell you something. Okay, I get it. I got to tell you something with this. The Virgin, Mary, the Virgin Mary was a real one, but I'll tell you why. Because instead of just admitting she cheated on Joseph, she just created an entire fucking religion that still exists to this day. <laughs> oh, we're getting canceled for that one. <laughs> you can have the controller now. Oh, all right. We went there. Ah, don't forget to give up. <laughs> nice words of fucking um, from appraisal 2116 there. Who's this guy? Commander Shepard. I mean, could be. <laughs> no, he came for the Virgin Mary, bro. Shout out to whoever the fuck that is. It's funny because, like, I think we said this in the last Who's one. Who's Melanie? Uh, it's like a, a, a friend of a friend. Oh. But you know how it says, like, it says you just came on, or your friend just came online? Yeah. It should just top, chop off the online part and be like, your friend just came. And then you're like, that's... <laughs> Good for them. <laughs> you just like a random notification while you're playing like Astrobot, and you're just like, Morgan has just came. Good for him. <laughs> Th thanks for the mental image, but uh, <laughs> yeah, wouldn't that be something if you could just like, or if you can edit uh, the greeting when they come online, right? So it's just like you can type in the words for like when somebody logs in. So it's like, okay, Morgan logged in, or Morgan, Morgan popped up, or you know. Can I write a message? If you like the, yeah, um, I thought you could, yeah. Because when you die, you can leave a message, right? Oh, I have to die. Well, I just died. So go write a message. How? F f go talk to the hot girl. No, I don't know how. Jesse, I'm going to fucking take this controller from you. Well, you would put it where you die. So <laughs> it's obviously something here kills them. Maybe it's a little bit later. Okay, bro. Anyway, let's, uh, let's continue on. This is a beautiful chasm. Did I say that right? Oh, yeah, these guys. C H A S M, chasm. I used to say chasm, and people used to chastise me for it. Fucking holy shit! Colonel Sanders needs to have a, a few bites of his popcorn chicken. No, dude, that's that's Santa. Either that or uh, Moses on crack. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Fuck guy. <laughs> Wait, did you say his name was Baldwin? Go back for Bold, a sec. Baldwin. Blacksmith Baldwin. Okay. Yeah. Never mind. So, <laughs> so it's not Moses on crack. No. <laughs> I'm stockpile Thomas. Um, this guy looks familiar. You know, he looks like he's like, what's up? You know what I mean? Like with that little head bob. Yeah, he looks like um one of those fucking diddlers. Like he'd like if you had like a hot friend, you know, that he'd, he'd probably hit on them. Like he'd you he would use you to get to the hot friend. That's the kind of fuck boy he looks like, you know? Yeah. Okay. Did I not repair my shit? You got to do that repair, man. Oh, I don't have enough souls. That's right. lame. Okay. Yeah. Moving on. You just got to, you know, David Draymond that shit. You know, give your soul to me for eternity, and then you're able to um, release your life. You know? Word. And that's, that's, that's the way the cookie crumbles. God, this game is fucking pretty. What a gorgeous looking landscape, I'll tell you that much. With a gorgeous looking character, too. We created a friggin' a beautiful monstrosity, I would say. It's a shame that the YouTube upload, just because it doesn't go to 4K doesn't uh, do it justice, unfortunately. But I guess we'll believe find me out. When, believe me when we're saying this, it's fucking gorgeous. We'll find out. See... That fucking dragon looked like it had tentacles coming from its mouth, and then... Like Cthulhu? Yeah, exactly. And I just realized that those fucking people he was munching. Yeah. That dragon looks fucking cool. I'm gonna go fight it. Yeah, shout out to Rathalos there. Yeah. Gates of... Bl b uh, the, the gates of Belvedere. So I'm playing, because I... I think we were trying to do this thing where me and Matthew will uh, switch the controller when we die. So I'm assuming that'll happen a lot. Yeah, Jesse just fucking abruptly took the controller from me and I started crying on the inside. And uh, a simple plan played through my head. I was wondering how this could happen to me and then I realized it's because I sucked at the game. <laughs> so whenever Jesse dies, I'll get the controller again. But for now, we're watching Jesse on his journey. It shouldn't take long, don't worry. I'll oh, die. Okay. Okay, I don't think there's anything in any of these things. So I'm just going to stop destroying stuff. Unless someone tells me otherwise. That's to go back to the Nexus, I'm assuming. <laughs> Excuse me. Mr. Mr. Hickety Hiccup over here. Do something with that barrel. What the hell is that? 
Is that a dead horse? Oh. There we go. What happened to Epona? Okay, took your soul. Now what? The touch the blood stain, maybe. Damn, don't prance on him. Poor little guy. At least they're gonna have horse meat for, for dinner if they survive. Would you eat horse? No. I mean I like if it was like the the last thing on earth and I had no fucking other choice. Like if I was in the wilderness and I was hungry and there was like a dead horse, yeah, I'd cook the horse. But I wouldn't go and kill a horse. If you have the white soul tendency, you can proceed, which I assume you don't. Excuse me, what's with this white nationalism bullshit? Oh, what the hell? If you have a white soul. Yeah, right? Okay, let's get out of here. All right, moving on. Remember the haberdashery? The haberdashery. Ever, ever since you said that, like, a few <laughs> weeks ago, I'm not going to lie, I've seen that word, like, a thousand times. Everywhere, hours. yeah, because you, now you realize it's a word, right? Yeah. It's I, one of those... I'm not even kidding you. Like, it's literally everywhere. <laughs> I told you, man. It's, yeah, it's it's weird. Yeah, we had, like, this weird stint when we were recording. I just fucking remembered that word existed, and I thought it was the funniest thing ever. So I started saying it more, and now I guess it's stuck in your mind. It really stuck through. Haberdashery! Can we find a haberdashery in this? Probably not. Oh, okay. <laughs> I would be surprised. Well, we found a dead horse, so. Okay, so I just realized I'm actually using stamina just just like you are, so. Yeah, man. I can't say shit. Yeah, so quit fucking hating. Quit hating on the newbie over here. Jesus Christ. I thought I did really good. But you know what? I'm admitting I was wrong. Yeah. And that's the first step of being great. Yeah, that's the first step to um, rekindling the uh, the companionship here. Um, okay, buddy. He fucking t he took a big leap there. Hey, just chill. Bros, bros. You're gonna die. And then I'm gonna have a controller. Bro, I gotta heal. Bro. No, you need to die so I can play. <laughs> <laughs> no, you. Go back to the boss. I don't think I can. I'll bet you anything he's got the keys to the haberdashery. Hey, I'll bet you. I have fucking anything. I'll bet you anything. Anyway, so I saw it. I saw that. The first time I saw that word was when I was playing Elder Scrolls Online. There was like uh, a store or whatever. Yeah. And it called itself the haberdashery. <laughs> That's like, are you sick. fucking serious? See, I told you, man. That's <laughs> dope. All the fucking real ones know what a haberdashery is. So now you're a real one. Why don't you, you know. explain to the fine folks what a haberdashery is in case they missed that episode? It's a very, I don't even think it was not on, on episode. It's a very, it's a very, um, it's a very dashing word, is it's what it is. Old school word. Yeah, it's um, it's an old school word for like an assortment of like men's uh, articles, like uh, accessories and stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're talking like ties, we're talking, um, I guess like, I guess fedoras, anything in terms of fashion and style, it's, it's something that is catered exclusively to men and men would go to haberdasheries to fucking, you know, pimp their image out. That's fair. Yeah. That's a haberdashery. I like how, look, look how fluid that is. You know Jesse, I mean? fucking vertigo. <laughs> it's so fluid, though. It is pretty nice. It um it actually has the same camera pen as uh, Genshin Impact. Like it has the motion blur, and that's what makes the big difference for next generation. Is that a lot of these games are incorporating that for their camera toggle. I'm the kind of person that takes. I I, I usually like to turn that off. That's, really? That's just that, that's just me. I feel I, like I have weird preferences. Yeah, that's bizarre, man. I feel like I would just get sick looking otherwise. I'm happy they did that. Because motion blur, it just yeah, it blurs everything around you, so it doesn't. It doesn't f fuck up your peripheral, you know? Yeah. Okay, you should be able to get from your peripheral. Yeah, get down from the haberdashery. What's with the floating sperm down there? Can you jump down there? No, you. Well, can you? I don't think so. <laughs> He's reloading. <laughs> He's just reloading. You fucked him up. You fucked him up and he stood. He stood his ground when you slashed him off of that. Good. That was head. wild. What a time to be alive, man. I felt like I was playing better than the last time. <laughs> last time I had the controller. Maybe. Playing a little more loose and, loose and fast. That's okay. Time for falling yeah, down. Yeah, see? That's why I said. Jump down there. Well, I feel like as you die, you'll be, get a chance to write a message there. Okay, jump. I jump from there. Like, like leap off. Oh, can you jump? Well, remember how you, I had to run up to the ledge and I pressed the circle button? And you could, like, I leap do that. over? I die. It said to jump down. No, it was a time for falling down. From a person that died previously, so they died from falling down. But there's sperm down there. No, you. Just fucking try it. Look for enemy. No. Weirdo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Well, you know, I think we're uh, I think we're coming to that time. To be honest with you, we're gonna go, we're gonna head our way into the dark caverns of this house. 
disheveled building thing, and we're going to see what's going to happen. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, we'll tune in for the next exciting episode. Please and thank you. That'd be great. Feel free to like and subscribe, and uh, we will see you for that third one. That's right. Everyone, we love you. Take care. Catch you on the flip side, yo. I'll sleep